I translated the Mario Party Superstars Japanese trailer. How you ask? Because I speak Japanese. Okay, okay, I used an app. And though the majority did translate well, there was one point in particular that, well... From Yoshi's Tropical Island, I ate mushrooms that can send stars, but I'll replace them. But overall, it does sound accurate and makes sense. Before we start the trailer, please hit that subscribe button as really helps the channel out. And I post a new Mario Party vid every week. Thanks, guys. Anyway, let's start the trailer. Introducing a Mario Party that can be enjoyed by one person or everyone. Mario Party Superstars. Roll the dice and advance through the board, and the person who collects more stars than anyone else wins the game. Collect the coins you earn to earn stars while fighting minigames. There are five types of boards you can play this time, from the Mario Party series released on the N64. It's a board full of gimmicks on remake Yoshi's Tropical Island. On Peach's birthday cake, get rivals coins when you plant a birthday cake flower. Pay attention to the player losing coins on Spaceland. Can you get to the star before the route will change? King Boo appears late at night on Horrorland. Take away the rival stars. And you can play against friends as well as against other players from all over the world. In random matches, even more, you can also use stamps to communicate. If you are with a friend, you can save on the way, so you can play without worrying any time. Pull Bowser's face accordingly to example and watch out for hot rope jump. Find a gap and slip through the penguin march. In addition to the battle with four players, there are also some mini-games divided into teams such as battles. 100 mini-games selected from the Mario Party series so far. Oh yeah! <laughs> what mini-games can be enjoyed in different ways on Minigame Mountain? Here are some of them. How many consecutive wins can you win against players from all over the world in survival? Play daily mini-games against players in daily trial. Combined play is the key to victory in a conference team game, tag team match, it's a brawl. Sports and puzzles where you can play mini games that can't be played on game board. Play along with all the- wait 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 a second, you can't play these on the game board? Oh man, that's a bit lame. Mario Party where you can play all the time with one person or everyone. Key things to point out in the trailer, and remember the translation may have not got this entirely accurate, but it looks as though several mini games will be excluded during normal play, which are Beach Volley Folly, Ice Hockey, Shell Soccer, Mario's Puzzle Party, Block Star, and Stick and Spin. These will be included, but only as separate mini-games, and not played during regular play on boards. But you can still play these online. Which is a bit of a shame, I can see why they did this, as these mini-games are fairly time-consuming. What's strange to me now, though, is there's only five dual mini-games. Let me repeat the translation in case I got it wrong. Also, I think Sugoroku means board game. At least that's what Google says. Now guys, this is bad news, but at least Waluigi's Rose Victory animation is back. Enough to make any woman or man go weak at the knees. No wonder he won People Magazine's Sexiest Man of the Year. We also got a brief description about the new modes including Daily Trial and Tag Team Match. So good to know a little bit more about that. What are your thoughts? Let me know down below. Hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed. And as always guys, thanks for watching.